Hi, my name is Josh. Today I'm going to show you how to attack a target with the Joint Direct Attack Munition, or JDAM, and Digital Combat Simulator with the A-10. Uh, I've already done a couple of things here for us, so let's go ahead and get into that. Right now, you want to click the TGP, which is already up. Make sure that you're in air-to-ground mode, which would be from this button. And I'm going to make a quick 180 to our targeting area. Now that I've done that, what I'm going to do is uh, I've already made the targeting pod my sensor of interest, so I'm going to slew the designator down here uh, by the airport that you can see. I'm going to hit the China hat forward a little bit, and uh, it'll zoom in, it'll uh, narrow the field of view for us, you see right here, and the DMS in and out will zoom in, uh, zoom in and out for us. What I'm going to do now is now that I've got the cross on it. I'm going to hold down the TMS right for just a second or so to make this my uh, SPI, my sensor point of interest, and I'm going to make this my point target. I'm going to enable the master arm, go to the DSIMS page, select the GBU 31 on station number 5, and go back to the TAD. Now this is very easy. What you will see here are a couple of little carrots that will uh, they'll move on the CCRP bombing mode here. What we're waiting on is uh, there's a thing with a little line in it that will start to move down and you can see that it's done that now. Hold down the weapon release for one second as long as this line that you see moving is in between the two carrots right here that means that you're good for release. Go ahead and zoom out a little bit with the, uh, the DMS, which I've already done. And I'm going to decrease the field of view and zoom back in so that we can see the impact here. I had quite a bit of altitude, so this will probably take a uh, few seconds before an impact actually. And that is a positive hit. I hope this might have answered a couple of questions. It was a little watered down. I didn't, uh, it was a little closer to the target than I wanted to be, so I didn't have time to explain things in detail. But I hope that uh, this explained a couple of things and answered some questions for you. So with that, I hope you enjoyed this. And if you like it, let me know and I'll make some more.